What's telling dudes? It's Torbrake here, and welcome back to Skyrim! In the last episode we headed out to Solitude, and we joined, well, kinda joined, we didn't really join there. We have been given an opportunity to join the Imperial Legion. Uh, so I've just been honestly bouncing around on this executioner stage, and I wanted to test a few of the, cells, uh, the spells that I've currently got. Uh, so one thing which I've been casting on the stage has been Muffle. And I've only cast it a few times, so bear in mind that when I haven't really cast Muffle as much. So previously my level was level 15. I've cast it maybe 4 or 5 times, so this is going to be the 5th or 6th time. So I'm nearly, I like, from basically just standing on the stage, I've nearly gained a level from basically just muffling all the time. Which is quite nice to actually think about it. I'll just wait for the magic to go back up. In a second. Once I do get the level, I'll probably chuck the level on um, illusion so I can take less magic up. Because if you notice, with muffle, it takes basically the entire magic bar for me. There we go. Cool, and that's a level up. I won't do any more. Um, do that. Cool. Um, what? So I want to go. Oh, we'll go magic again. We'll have to go health very soon. Uh, yeah, so we'll do illusion. All illusion works on high level people. Yeah, we'll do illusion. We'll start branching into that as well. Cool. So, illusion. Should. That was still quite a lot of magic. Hold on. No, uh, skills, 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 skills. Yeah, we do give it. Ah, fair enough, okay. Well, anyway, so in this episode, uh, we've been asked by the Imperial Legion to go clear out a fort uh, from bandits because they plan on occupying that fort for their own personal gain. So we'll go head out to the fort, we'll go take it out. From there, we'll head back and we'll see whether the. Legion is ready to accept us as a true Imperial soldier to fight against. <laughs> I still got muffle. I'm super silent as I run along. I'm the ninja. Ninja. Uh, I don't know where the fort is. We'll make our way over there very shortly. Ooh, is there going to be stuff? Is that a farm? No, that's just a fence. Never mind. I thought it was a farm. Uh, what was I saying? So, um... Yeah, so whether we could be an Imperial soldier to fight the Rebel Stormcloaks. Lydia, come on board. I need to grab more of this stuff as well. We ate a lot of different ingredients. I really want to make more potions. Uh, I want to make a lot of health potions, because I feel like I'm going to need a lot of health potions, and I don't particularly want to buy health potions myself. I've got enough currently, but I think health potions can be made from wheat for the most part. Ooh, the snowberry. Uh, blue mountain flower is one of the restore health, so that's why I pretty much grab any that I see. Uh, thistle doesn't really help so much. We are super tired right now. Uh, it's 6.30 in the evening, alright. We might need to wait around for a second. Uh, how do we get up there? We'll have to find a bit of an, uh, in a uh, a bit of a cut to get up to the fort, so we can clear it out. Claim that, claim that, and grab you. Grab you. A bit of a traveler here. Hello, who are you? I'm on my way to Windhelm to join up with the Stormcloaks. Ulfric has the right of it. I don't want to join the Stormcloak Rebellion. No. Is that the way to join the... That was how the quest marker started. Just approaching a random farmer and going, I am going to Ulfric Stormcloak and join him. He has a right to rule Skyrim. Hell no, there's not any way to join any faction. You want to join a strong independent faction. One which guarantees peace and security for all of the citizens of Skyrim. Because Skyrim ultimately belongs to the Empire. The Empire looks after its 
citizens, its own interests. It will take out those barbarians. Oh, hello, who are you? I think you have the same... I've still got Muffle, and that's probably why he hasn't noticed me. Am I meant to be detected? Oh, right, okay. <laughs> Never mind. He's not a bandit. I thought he was going to be a bandit. I was going to be like, oh, yes, this is our time. Alright, let's get out of there. Grab some of those. Hello, do you want to talk? I am waiting for a good death. Good death? Yes. Were I to simply lay down and die, it would not please Malachi. Why do you wish to die? My time has come. I am old. Too old to become chief. It would be wrong for me to take wives at this age. So I will die. Malakath has given me a vision of a glorious death. I am to wait here until it finds me. As you can see, it has not yet arrived. You don't look that old to me. Certainly you're still strong, capable warrior. Indeed. One should find his death while he can still call himself a proper man. We orc men are not like these Nords and Imperials who carry on until they are grey and feeble and their hair falls out. To cling to something past its usefulness is unseemly. How much more so when that thing is you? It seems there's no talking you out of us. You should leave. I don't want you scaring off my good death. I'm. G I like how he's taking up these saber cat guys here. Ooh, teeth. I'll take you. Uh, I want to fight him. So I don't want to fight him. I just want to save because I don't know how strong he's gonna be. Um, I can murder you. You are not here to grant me a good. Are you sure about this? Yeah. Hmm. We shall see. Never oh God. Uh, okay, you're actually not too bad. You're actually not too bad. <laughs> yeah! Goodbye, sword. I do not want you anyway. You die. Hooray! I'll take Iron Ingot. Nord Meat, I'll take you. Studded Armor. Uh, oh, oh, that's a seal stone. Uh, steel sword as well. We don't need you. What do I have for my armor? Oh right, it's a um, same. There's no pants or anything. Uh, so 26, and then mine will be exactly 22, but how 30? Nah, I'll keep mine for now. It's obviously bottom of the barrel stuff, so I want to change it later. Ooh, and the Aurora's back. Hello, Aurora. All right, let's head out to our destiny. Let's head out to the fort. I don't know how far away the fort is. Probably shouldn't be too much longer. Should be around here. Alright. Alright, that'll be the fort. What time is it? 8pm? Ah, oh, we'll wait for... 12 hours. Yeah, we'll just wait for it to be day. Make it look a little bit nicer. It's still very, very, very bright for it to be 3 a.m. in the morning. Look at that. Ooh, okay, cool. We've sat here in the cold. I am... I should be so freezing right now. Hey, Lydia. Alright. We're going to take it slow. We're moving in. Even though we're miles away. Uh, I want to grab... Let's grab the iron armor and we'll grab muffle. Cool. Sneaky sneaky. Alright, let's start by being a ninja. That's a watchman. Can we sneak past the watchman? Hidden.
Can we sneak around this way? Can we get closer to the wall? <laughs> I'm slowly getting detected and undetected. I, th I don't think there's a way unless I turn completely invisible. I don't really have an invisibility though. Which stinks. Oh, there's a patrol over there, right. You know what, we'll try it. Well, we discovered the fort anyway. Is the patrol gonna come back? I need the invisibility spell. That's going to be one of the next ones I'm going to get in terms of a spell. I want to buy that property before I buy an invisibility spell, but the invisibility spell honestly won't cost you much. Alright, screw this. Alright, we're going to conjure and flames. Alright, that is my familiar. That's my sword and we'll go from there all right let's jump out of here hello i am here Ooh, that bounce sword does massive massive amount no my familiar no ow bandits are do nothing to me i'm gonna grab you cool <laughs> oh my god, my bounce sword does so much. I'll grab you, um, loot everyone while we're, while we're still here. Uh, what else have we got around here? Hello! How about you don't shoot an arrow at me? Oh, slice across the throat. I want to actually loot you. Before we get out of here, grab you. Cool. And... Is there another enemy? Well, the quest is not complete, so I'm imagining there's another enemy around here. I don't see the enemy, though. Oh! And my wolfie is still around. Hey! Okay. <laughs> now you're no longer around. Well, I guess I have to go in here and also clear the bandits inside here. Since there's no one outside. Should I sneak it? Huh? Hello! Nah, we're good. Before the other guys come along, we'll grab you. Ooh, and battle axe. I wish I was going. Heavy, uh, heavy, um, as a playthrough, Heavy doesn't seem too bad. <laughs> Victory is yours! It is mine, thank you very much. Alright, I want to grab your loot as well. Uh, what else have we got around here? We'll run through and grab some of the other stuff later. Hello! Ooh! Ooh! Okay, you are a bit of a high level. And you're dead. Lydia helps. Ooh! That's some good stuff. I'll grab you, I'll sell you later. 102 gold, yes! I need some of that stuff to replace. Walkish mace. I'll sell you. Sell you. Sell it for later. Is that everything? <laughs> they got a random gourd in there. Read the golden ribbon or mirror. Ah, oh, I didn't want to increase archery. Whatever. Take garlic. Yes, I want to take the garlic. Uh, none of this stuff has ingredients or anything, so we're good. Iron gauntlets, iron mace, iron greatsword. Banded iron armor. That's heavy, so we'll leave it alone. Don't need it. Wooden bowl. Don't care. Have we finished the quest? Lock of my scroll of my own weak magic poison? Uh, nothing there. What's in here? We'll loot everything. Child annual. And odd. Charcoal. I just want to quickly check that. Does it matter? Blah.
That's cool. I will keep it. I might read it later. Oh, there it is. There's the last bandit. Where are you coming from? Over here. Where are you? Oh, you're all the way over here. Dude! Dude! Seriously, mate. Now, is that the quest over? There might be another person on the other tower, Bone. Yeah, there's another person. Maybe they're spawning now. I don't know. Are you up here? You did. I, I need a bit of destruction magic spell. I'll get one soon. Amulet of Stendar. I'll grab it to sell. Or break down. One or the other. Longbow. Imperial bow. Imperial bow. I'll take you. I haven't had you before. I may stay. Doesn't really matter. Uh, will I survive if I fall down here? We'll try it. Yeah. <laughs> We're fine. Totally fine. It's to practice conjuration. Uh, restoration. I haven't gained a single skill point in restoration yet. Alright, I, I keep pressing the wrong button. I don't know where the last one is, Wolfie. Do you know? You wanna go help? You wanna go help find this last bandit? We've just killed two other bandits. I don't know where this last one might be. Oh, there's an arrow pointing here. Okay, there's a... On the prison? Right, I have missed this multiple times yet. Can you not? <laughs> Could you not? I've had enough of you guys. Can we just leave? Um, I don't want any of you. That is not a note, so I can't use it at all. Oh. Oh, right. You are a bandit. I thought you were Lydia. Yay, level up. Grab the gold. You're a... Oh, you're Lydia. Whoops. Hey, we cleared everyone out now. I'm starting to get worried that it was pugs, but no, that's just me being unobservant. Ignore me. Alright, what have we got around here? Ooh, rock warbler egg. That must be an ingredient. Right, I think we've got enough. Let's do our standard taste test of drugs. Let's take some drugs. What have we got that we haven't tasted yet? Saber Cat Tooth is Restore Stamina, very nice. Oh, oh right, we've already had the egg, right, so it's just a Saber Tooth. Cool, we just restored some stamina, very nice. Um, everything is alright around here, so we're good. Uh, chest, what's in the chest? I'll take all of you, thank you very much. Brief history. Uh, sure, I don't particularly want to read it straight away. From the door, uh, open the door there. Nothing I can pray to stop picking on, nothing inside those prisons. Fair enough, uh, nothing in there, nothing in there, nothing in there. Cool, we are good, we did it! Kind of impressive that they asked one, well, two people to clear out an entire uh, for anyway, uh, I'm gonna go. We'll go Magicka once more. At a later stage, we can always go and increase health. Health will be the next one. Oh, uh, we did the illusion actually. I don't know what I want. Um, we gotta work on alchemy, so we don't. We won't do anything there yet. What have we unlocked in Conjuration? Can something Antronax or race undead twice as far away can cast apprentice level conjuration. Tell you what, 
I'm gonna go Apprentice Conjuration. And then we'll grab a new type of spell sometime soon. Alright, where do we want to go? We want to go back to Solitude, right? Yeah. Fast track back to Solitude. And we can go back to the general and go, Hey, I deserve to join the Imperial Legion. I have cleared out the fort as you asked. I, um, the name of that woman, I think it was coming up as Rike. Rike? Possibly not really. Probably not. Anyway, let's tell them that we've completed it. Yes, Hello. Sir. What? You have a problem for me. Castle Tower. What a great name for a castle. Let's see. Tell me again what why I'm wasting men chasing after a fairy tale. What do you need? If Ulfric gets his hand on that crown, it won't be a fairy tale. It'll be a problem. Don't you Nords put any stock in your own traditions? I thought the Moot chose the king. We're backing Elisif. When the Moot meets, they'll do the sensible thing. Not everyone's agreed to the Moot. You've been here long enough to know that Nords aren't always sensible. We follow our hearts. So what? Ulfric gets this crown and then suddenly he's High King? No, it's not as simple as that. But the Jagged Crown would be a potent symbol for his cause to rally around. But if we found it first... And we gave it to Elisif. In the absence of the moot, it would further legitimize her claim. Perhaps. I'm entrusting you with what resources I can spare. But I'm warning you, if this turns out to be a waste of time and men... It won't be a waste. Make sure you take the auxiliary here. You can send him back when you get there and find nothing but old bones and cobwebs. The Stone Fist's no fool. He's found the crown, but we'll get to it first. Welcome back, soldier. I'm glad you made it in one piece. I'll send men to garrison the fort right away. You did well. I'm impressed. But before we go any further, it's time for you to officially join the Legion. Yes! Speak with General Tullius. He'll administer the oath. Yes! In joining the Legion, you'll be taking an oath binding you to the service of the Emperor, and thus to every citizen of the Empire. Are you prepared to make that commitment? Yes! Well then, repeat after me. Upon my honor, I do swear undying loyalty to the Emperor, Titus Mead II. Upon my honor, I do swear undying loyalty to the Emperor Titus Mead II. And unwavering obedience to the officers of his great empire. And unwavering obedience to the officers of his great empire. May those above judge me, and those below take me, if I fail in my duty. May those above judge me, and those below take me, if I fail in my duty. Long live the Emperor. Long live the Empire. Long live the Emperor. Long live the Empire. Welcome to the Imperial Legion, soldier. Just remember, we take care of our own. Once you're in the Legion, you're in it for life. Speak to Baron. He's normally out by the forge. He'll get you outfitted. Yes. Now, if I'm not mistaken, Legate Ricca has a special assignment for you. <laughs> Fail, join the Stormcloak Rebellion. Are we finished? Uh oh. Okay, I can just take it. no fool. He's found the crown, but we'll get to it first. All right, we're going to talk about the crown, aren't we? Hello. Welcome to the Legion Auxiliary. Listen up. Welcome I'm to the Legion Auxiliary. Listen up. Ulfric's right hand man, Galmar Stonefist, has located what he believes is the final resting place of the Jagged Crown. We're going to make sure he doesn't get his hands on it. The rest of my men are already assembling outside Corvinjum. I'll meet you there as soon as I finish up here. 
Right, okay, uh, Jago Crown, what is it? A legendary crown, dating back to King Harald's time, or before. A powerful relic of a golden age, long since past. Legend has it that the crown is made from the bones and teeth of ancient dragons, and is said to increase the power of the wearer. Whatever the truth, if Ulfric gets his hands on it, it would be a powerful symbol around which to rally support for his cause. Aha. Uh -huh. Well, we know that the crown is in uh, Corvinjun because there was that one guy. Well, to be frank, we don't. Its location was lost with King Borgus when the Great Hunt killed him off while on his Lushan campaigns. Supposedly, his body was brought back to Skyrim and secretly buried with the crown. Knowledge of that location was lost in the Wars of Secession. But my agents report that Galmar is pretty damn convinced Corvin June is the tomb of King Borgus. I know Galmar. We fought in many wars together. He's not a sentimental man taken to fancy. If he believes the crown is there, he's likely found it. Aha. Uh -huh. Blah blah blah. I don't really need don't to know your intentions. Get to Corvin June as soon as you're ready. I'll meet you there. We'll head over as soon as we're ready. Off that junk at bits and pieces. Blah blah blah. Uh, first we'll practice a uh, couple of things. We'll do the damage health potion. Uh, let's hopefully find... Okay. We haven't found anything in that. That's fine. Uh, let's do another one of those. Yay! Alchemy's gone up. Lovely. I resist poison. Do one of you. And... Oh, Rock Wobbler Egg does it as well. Right, okay. Resource health. Cool. Haven't learnt anything there. Restore stamina. Haven't learnt anything there. Cool. But we gained some experience levels. Very nice indeed. Alright, let's head out of here. Hail, Samana. Conjure me up a warm bed, would you? I lost some of the dialogues. Uh, where am I going to get outfitted? Wait, which? High Moon Cave. Okay. Down to the southwest. We're following this area to get outfitted. Exploring. Okay, so over here, fair exploring. enough. Hello. I would like to get outfitted, please. Seems there's no end to the needs of the Imperials. But what can I help you with? General Tullius says you'd get me outfitted. Yep. I just have one question for you. Light, medium, or heavy? Light. All right, here you go. Should keep you light on your feet and hold up decent enough if you wind up trading blows with the enemy. Now that's it. One free outfit per soldier. You lose that or get it banged up. You'll need to pay like everyone else. Thank you. Return. Actually, uh, what have you got for sale? I believe I've got like heaps of daggers to sell. Two, okay. Also, they do not sell for very much, so I should not be collecting them. Imperial bow is a 30. Uh, so that one does 10, 8, and 30. 6, 5, and 10. So we'll sell the long bow, we'll keep the imperial. That's fine, I'll favorite you in a second. Orcish mace, I didn't want really, didn't really need you. Uh, I got a steel dagger, which is fine. Sell you. Sell the steel swords, don't need you. Um, cool, that's fine. Uh, banded iron shield, definitely not using it, we'll sell it. Oh, Burand has heaps of, heaps of money, that's very nice indeed. Lever armor 29. Do you have a tanning around here? You do, can I use it? There we go. <laughs> Stop using it. Cool. Uh, let's make... Ooh, what do I want to... Wait, what do I need? Uh, lever... Oh, I guess you turn it into lever first and then from lever you turn it into straps. Oh, that's so annoying. You have to go from one to the other in order to create lever. Alright, so we've got some lever. Can I make the... lever armor now? 
Oh, you need uh, strips. Need four liver, but I've got a liver, and that's fine. And then I need some strips. Okay, that's fine. Four liver strips, so I've got ten liver now. Can I make the liver armor? I can. Right. Um, so that means that I should have probably a much better armor. Leather armor, 29 light. 29 light, and then that one is 22 light. And that one's 26 light. Aha! Uh -huh. Very nice indeed. Braces are 7, I think the liver braces are 8, so we might craft that. Turns out liver is much better than most of the imperial armor that I've been given. Fascinating. Um, right, so I'll chuck that on, I think. So, liver braces, chuck that on, that's better than seven. And then the liver oh, boots, so that's eight, fine. Now we'll make the boots. We'll just make some boots. Uh, we still got a little bit more. I'll oh, just make another one of that for some experience. Jewelry. Oh, I can make some of this right now. If I make that, then it should be sell for quite a bit. Twenty-one, lovely. How do I look now? Honestly, not that much different. Yeah, I don't really look any different at all. Leather braces, leather boots, so those look a little different. Other than the that the armor is the same and the helmet is the exact same. If you need potions, head over Very to cool. Ah, uh, with it, I I think we'll end off the episode, guys. We conquer the fort. We've joined the Imperial Legion. I have no idea where Lydia is. Is Lydia here? Lydia? What happened to Lydia? Lydia, are you still here? Is that the Imperial Soldier? Howdy Soldier, it is me. I'm an auxiliary. How are you doing? How are you doing? Has any of you seen a woman around here? By the name of Lydia? You're not a Lydia. I thought Lydia was last in the dungeon. So why'd you join up with the Legion? My father was Legionnaire, and his before him. I'm gonna try and search for Lydia. Uh, in the meantime, else. thank you guys so much for watching. If I can't find Lydia, we might have to go without her. Wow, I thought we were gonna last a lot longer than that. Uh, I thought she was gonna last a lot longer than that, but... Oh, what do I know, apparently? Oh, I have no idea where mm. she is. Alright, I'll try to find her. Thank you so much for watching, guys. <gasps> There's Lydia! Where'd you come from? I'm right behind you. What do you mean you were right behind me? Indeed, I had to go try and find you! <sighs> I thought you had died. Right, I can tell this is going to be a little stressful. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Have yourself guys a great day, alright? Take care. Enjoy your See you when I see you. Peace!